agility and fragility and a lot of my work looks at materials that are verging on collapse and that can be a metaphor for environmental collapse or psychological collapse. It's kind of loosely talking about the idea of things, a sense of things being on the brink. This one here, um, Why a Mother, I've been reading uh, uh, um, Harry Harlow's work, um, Psychological Experiments in the uh, 60s and 70s. Uh, I'm also quite interested in our relationship to the non-human and the experiments that he did with um, primates. Um, so I guess it feeds into my interest in environmental issues and the way we treat the non-human. My work is just centered on drawing and telling the stories through a female perspective. So you see most of my work is a reconfiguration of power dynamics. And that's done in these pieces here through looking at the grief through the eyes of the mother, the grief through the eyes of the child at loss, and uh, universal themes of redemption in life. Because I like to morph, as you can tell, with a rabbit having human like hands. I don't distinguish between animate, inanimate, wildlife, as we call here, and separate because there's that connect disconnect between. Western culture between human and animal life, but I don't think that's true. I believe that we're all connected, and so I play around with that in my drawings. Lucy is grieving, so she's the mother of the Cyclops that Jason murdered. We don't usually think about her loss, but that was someone's child. And so part of that is there is a face, half of her is in grief, and the other half is she's still looking up and hopeful because she is asking the gods for another child. So at the same time, there's that mix of wanting more and grieving the loss. So these paintings are kind of based on ritual motifs. So in particular food, that's why like birthday cakes and food is a daily ritual as well. I was looking at folklore as a whole, but then I kind of looked into kind of specific genres of folklore, which led me to ritual. And then looking at ritual as a form of self-comfort kind of became more important to me than just folklore in general. I'm trying to remove context clues because I kind of want, if you look at it, I kind of want you to make your own sort of interpretation of it, but I want the general idea of like isolation to be kind of the key from.
在你成功的外，所以你就靠你做 critics and fill the whole canvas for a change, and then realize that actually something works in this. So it's the Cubic style, the kind of impressionistic version of a photograph from 1969, which has some emotional weight. A bunch of images combined from when I wasn't able to be in a painting place. I put them all together in one space, so that's why it's so busy. I know it's busy. But when you spend time with it, it becomes less busy and more alive. My dad again popping into this one, same place. Um, that's my daughter there, um, her son there. So um, people are, you know, I'm not particularly close to them, but they were split up for me. Um, but I was able to put them all in here.